The recent student government elections were closed February 27th. Here are some highlights from the announcement. I just feel really honored and blessed to be able to represent the entire university as a whole. Um, I mean to represent 15,000 students. We both worked really hard at this just to really be advocates for the students. And now that um, we are able to be in these positions, we're just able to create a bigger change on campus. My presidential candidate opponent was a very strong candidate. So I was very prepared to uh, you know, see a loss and accept it with pride. Following the Evolution Party's win, Josh Ballin, the current student body president, says that he hopes to guide the new presidency into office. I'm extremely excited about Jacob Goldman uh, being the next student body president. I believe that he will do an, an absolutely incredible job this year. I will help Jacob. I'll train him. Um, we have an extensive process that we're going to go through. And this entrance process will open the door to the Evolution Party's initiatives. So my first initiative is to automatically do that approachability aspect. So open up that uh, open door policy. Using kindness can go such a long way, and I think that creating that open door policy that I'm very passionate about and that was one of our goals uh, starts with just being kind. The current student government is coming to a close. Still, Ballin says, there is more work to be done. Um, we have completed over 50 initiatives um, to give back to the student body that promoted diversity, that promoted um, and enhanced our campus culture, that promoted sustainability. Well, we do have some initiatives still going through the pipeline um, that we're hoping to um, release in the last month. I'm excited to, for the student body to see what those are. Signing off, I'm Samantha Romero reporting from ENTV.